Hello, my name is Elise and this week at work I heard about a really interesting news uh, issue in Canada right now. It's actually now forbidden for Islamic women who wear the burqa, which is the veil that covers their face, to wear that when they're taking their oath to be a Canadian citizen if they're immigrating. And at work, two of the women were discussing it and I overheard them and they were really, really celebrating this, saying that if they want to come to Canada, they need to act like Canadians. And one of the women actually said that it was a good thing that we have immigrants because elsewise we wouldn't have convenience stores. So I was really taken aback by this. And my feeling on this is that they're coming to Canada because it's a free country. And if they want to wear their burqa, I think that that's fine. It, it doesn't bother me personally. The argument against this, given by uh, Jason Kenney, he is the Minister of Citizenship and Immigration. I have written down something that he said and uh, he recited that it is a matter of deep principle that goes to the heart of our identity and our values of openness and equality. But my feeling is if we want to argue equality, then women should really have the right to wear whatever they desire. And if you're going to talk about the fact that wearing veils isn't Canadian, then you should ban kimonos and kilts and turbans and hula skirts even at your citizenship ceremonies because that's not Canadian culture even though for me Canadian culture now is really very very multicultural. Another thing that he did say was that the burqas covered the woman's mouths and so it was difficult for immigration officers to see if they were actually reciting the oath. And that is fair enough, but I'm not sure if it really justifies forcing these women to wear something that they're uncomfortable in. Uh, now that's just my point of view and I really appreciate you just hearing me out, checking it out. Thanks. Bye-bye.